Oh, yeah. What's going on, Fight Cam family? It's Coach PJ back with another four-round intermediate combo buildup. Now, if you have not already got your dynamic warm-up in, I highly encourage you to hit that X now and to go get a five- or ten-minute dynamic warm-up in. Reason being because this four-round workout is going to be kind of challenging, okay? And our dynamic warm-up here is only two minutes of shadow boxing. So I want to make sure that you're loose and that you're ready to maximize this workout. Now, in our workout today, we're going to build up seven punch combo, and then we're going to build up an eight punch combo and wait for it. Round number three, we're going to put those bad boys together. So today will be a little challenging. We're going to work mind fitness and body fitness as we improve our skills. You know what it is. Let's get right to our warm up here with some shadow boxing in three and two and one. Nice and light. Let's get full extension on your ones and your twos. Like I said, we're going to take our time warming up that body getting ready. Now these eight punch and seven punch combos, oh, they're gonna feel quick. Transition to uppercuts now, nice and light. If you feel confident and comfortable, you can move the feet a little bit as long as you're still rotating, turning that knuckle, driving with the hip, all right? And extend and use that trunk. That's where you get that power behind the uppercuts and the hooks. Speaking of that, let's go to hooks now. Three and four, still shifting, turning, rotating that body. Believe it in yourself, because I got to tell you, just because it said four rounds didn't mean it's going to be an easy workout. And today we're going to get to it. Give me a little freestyle action here as we get into that latter half of our two minute shadow box round. So let's get to it. We have ourselves a lovely seven punch combo. We're going to work to one, one, two, lead block high, two, three, rear block high, three, Four. That's combo A. One, one, two, block, two, three, block, three, then the four. Then combo B. Combo B, we set up with the one, two again, but a little different. One, two, slip, slip. Five B, three, four. Roll rear, six, three. One more time, let's see it. One, two, slip, slip. Five B, three, four. Roll rear, six, three. Don't worry, those punches are gonna be easy by the end of this four rounds. So stay confident, stay comfortable. Last 15 seconds, get those hands flowing. Come on. Ha, 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 ha. 10 more seconds in our warm up. I want that heart rate at least a little elevated. Come on. We're done here in three, in two, and one. Now go ahead and glove up if you have not already get hydrated, and get your mind back into the fight. Now with round one, we got 200 punches as our minimum goal. That's right, 200. That's gonna be in every round except the last one. In today's workout, we have three rounds of combo buildup, one round of conditioning. So first round, one, one, two. Nice and easy, double jab, follow it with the cross. After that, we're gonna add the lead block high. You're gonna counter back with a two and a three. So one, one, two. Lead block high, two, three. Then we go to the final part in combo A. One, one, two. Lead block high, two, three. Then we have rear block high, three, and then the four, all right? From there, we finish our final minute with a one, two coast, and then a power coast with a one and a two, and two slips. You'll know why later on. Here goes round number one. Let's go get some. One, one, and then the two. Double jab, rear cross, right behind it. Try to snap that hand right behind that second jab. Don't give your opponent time, right, to react and to see that jab setting up this hand. Throw it right behind it. There it is. Really sit down on that punch. So drive your body weight through it. Use the legs as you get there. Three, two, one. Here it is. Let's add that lead high block two, three, one, one, two, lead high block, two, three. Make your opponent miss with that block. Make them pay with that cross and that hook. Ha, 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 ha. All right, I need you to get that hand up high, block, make your counter work here, okay? Ha, ha, ha. We go to our final phase of combo A. Here it is, ready, set, let's go. One, one, two, lead block high, two, three, rear block high, three, four, okay? 
One, one, two, block, two, three, block, three, four. Slow and control, it's gonna always be the way to go. Ha, ha. Now remember, every other punch is gonna essentially be a counter shot. Ha, ha, counter shot. Ha, ha. So try to make those punches quick. You don't wanna delay. You gotta make your opponent pay, baby. Ha, ha, ha. 30 more seconds. Find that rhythm, find your groove. Once you start to see it, that's when not only does the fun begin, but you start to see that output go up. Come on, last 15 seconds. Make your opponent miss, make them pay. Last three, come on, two and one. Ones and twos, coast it out. Let's get there. 30 seconds here, full extension. I need you to work here, okay? Elbows back to the rib cage. Take a deep breath in. Sit down into those legs and drive a little faster here, okay? Ha. Four rounds does not mean easy work. Yeah. All right, here we go. Final little phase in round number one. You're gonna give me a power coast. One, two, with two slips. Here it is, ready, set, let's go. One, two, slip, slip. Again, 75, 85% power. I want full speed on the slip. Ha, ha. Get out the way quick. 15 more seconds, go. Ba, ba. Let's grow. Ba, ba. Now you can slip both ways, but I prefer going off of that rear hand, slipping to the rear. Ba, ba. Come on, three, two, and one. Deep breath in, recover, get hydrated if you need. Now, one down, three more to go. Round number two, we still have 200 punches as our minimum goal, and we have combo B. Let's get there. Now, you just did the one, two with two slips. So that's where we go from. One, two, slip, slip. From here, you're gonna have to move inside, hit the five B, then a three. 30 seconds. One, two, slip, slip, five B, three. A real easy tip is to, as you slip on that second time, step in a little bit. Gives you better range and distance for the 5B3. From there, we add one, two, slip, slip, 5B, three, four, roll. Again, one, two, slip, slip, 5B, three, four, roll. Finally, one, two, slip, slip, 5B, three, four, roll, six, three. We have a coast and a power coast just like we did in round one, and you got this. Let's go win! Here we go, one, two, slip, slip, five, B, three. Again, we're just gonna start there, nice and controlled combo with a double lead at the end. So, rear hand glued back at home, protecting yourself. Ha, ha. Still try to make that slip pretty fast, pretty consistent, ha, ha. and keep that lead hand up as you slip. Ha, ha. Get ready to add to it, here it is. Let's go. One, two, slip, slip. Five B, three, four. Then you roll to the rear. One, two, slip, slip. Five B, three, four, roll. All right. Now you know how to roll. It's up to you if you want to stay in the place. You want to move with that one foot and move your angle, or again, moving with two feet and displacing your opponent so you can make them pay later on. Here we go. Final phase. Ready? One, two, slip, slip. Five B, three, four. Roll to that rear side, six, three, all right? Every single punch but one goes up top. One, two, slip, slip. Five B, three, four, roll rear, six, three. On that reset, get a couple jabs, do it again. Boom, 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 ha, 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 ha. Come on. On both the slip and the roll, try to get there fast so you can get that counter just as fast. Never want to make your opponent miss and just hang out there. What a waste. Same thing on the roll. As I slip and roll through, land a four, make your opponent miss, make them pay. Don't wait for it. Come on. We're almost there. You ready to coast? Here we go. Six, five, B, three. Six up top, five, B, three. Up, up, 
Uppercut, uppercut body, hook. Take your time, find the rhythm. You have to go up, down, up, up, down, up, up. Come on. You're going to love this drill later on. Final 30 seconds of round number two. We got power coast, 5B, 6B. Turn it up. Ready? Let's go. 5B, 6B. Punch through the bag, not just to it. Use that body of yours as a frame of reference for where these punches are going. Ha, ha, ha. If you got footwork in you, utilize it. Ha. You can even pendulum step. Ha, ha, ha. Seven more seconds. Come on. Keep digging. Ha, ha. We're almost there. Round number two is done in three, two. Ha. There it is. Two down. Two more to go. Take a deep breath in. Recover, relax. You're halfway through the fight, which means we still got halfway to go. So hold strong, keep bringing that fighter out from within. Now round number three, we put it together. We're gonna start off with a coast, three and four. Give yourself a little active recovery. Then we get to the fun. You're gonna do the first combo, A, four, 30 seconds. One, one, two, lead high block, two, three, rear high block, three, four. Then 30 seconds of combo, B. One, two, slip, slip. Five B, three, four, roll, six, three. Then finally, you put them together. One, one, two, lead high block. Two, three, rear high block. Three, four, one, two, slip, slip. Five B, three, four, roll, rear, six, three. We close the show with a power coast. Three up top, four up top, three B down low, four B down low. Let's go. Round number three, start it off, finish strong. Threes and fours, all right? Coast, groove, and just move. You only gotta make 200 punches. I believe in you. Now here's the part, right? You're putting that seven punch combo together with that eight punch combo. It's gonna be challenging, but believe me, I know you can do it. We start off, right, getting a little refresher. We're gonna do 30 seconds of combo A and then combo B. And then we piece it together. Ready, let's get to it. One, one, two, lead block high. Two, three, rear block high. Three and four. Work it. And then perfect it, okay? You should feel really good, especially after that block to land that punch. Now on that, try to keep your eyes on your target. I don't want to block high and then turn away. Can't see what my opponent's doing there. Here we go, ready? Let's go to combo B. One, two, slip, slip. Five B, three, four, roll rear, six, three. One, two, slip, slip, five B, three, four, roll, six, three. Again, find that balance, find that cadence where you can kind of flow through it almost with ease. And if you don't feel that yet, right, you come back to this workout after trying it a second time. Build the progress. Here it is, long 15 punch combo. Let's get it. One, one, two, lead block high, two, three, rear block high, three, four, one, two, slip, slip, five B, three, four, roll rear, six, three. Now that's a mouthful, right? But again, we break it down one punch at a time. Then you can start to build it together, okay? One, one, two, lead block, two, three, Rear block, three, four, roll, four, three. One, two, slip, slip. Five B, three, four, roll rear, six, three. And that's how you crush a 15 punch combination. Come on, I need you to dig here. Last 10 seconds. If you mess up the combo, it's okay. I mess this up all the time when I'm putting it together, okay? Here we go. Three, two, one, power coast. Three up top, four up top. Three B down low, four B down low. Give me 85, 90% power here, come on. You are more than a prospect. I think you're a contender. And by you crushing through that last round, showed me, you got what it takes, baby, come on. Keep fighting, keep working through it. We're done, round number three, in three, in two, and, and one. Take a deep breath in. 
relax, recover, get your mind back in the game. All right, last round, best round, round number four of four. I'm gonna go ahead and get hydrated. You do the same, you have certainly earned it. Mm. Ah. Long combo, fun, but now we condition. So most of this round, it's all power coast. Good news is we're gonna be in 15 second increments. First one, we're gonna lead block high. We're gonna rear block high, and then we're gonna hit the three. So two blocks, three. We're doing that 15 seconds. Then the other way, two blocks up top. Then we counter with the four. Boom, boom, boom. You're gonna roll, you're gonna give me a power six, three, and then our final move will really be slip, slip, five B. Slip, slip, six B. Last phase, it's all freestyle. It's in your hands, baby. Let's get better and let's drill. Lead block, rear high block, land the three. Block, block, counter. Now on these drills, I need about 75, 90% power here. Block, block, counter. Give me one more and then we go the other way. Let's go. Block, block, counter. Block, block, and then the counter. Take your time, bump, bump. But also don't take your time. <laughs> here it is. <laughs> Work that sweet science. Three, two, one. Let's counter. We're going to roll. Six, three. Roll to the rear side. Six, three. After you land at three, come back to your stance so you can again roll to the rear side. Otherwise, it's going to feel really awkward. Roll. Six, three. Come on. Dig. Now, <laughs> these 15 second increments are going to make you have to work when you're freestyle. Trust me. I know. Here we go, ready, set, let's go. Give me two slips, give me a 5B. Give me two slips, give me a 6B. We're here for a minute. Try to keep it at two slips, not a three. So slip to the lead, slip to the rear, six. Slip to the rear, slip to the lead, five. Back and forth. This is where you need to work. The purpose of this drill, right, ha, is going to be to build that power, build that endurance, help you to counter quicker and to develop ha, our blocking reflexes. Ha. We've already put together some really long combos today. Now we just drill, work on the skills that pay the bills. Ha. All right, final little phase, you're going to coast Power coast, burnout, and power coast again. Here it is. It's all in your hands. Freestyle coast. 15 seconds, nice and light. I need you to work, though, especially if you have not hit 200 punches yet. It's only 15 seconds. Come on. Keep driving. Keep shifting that body weight through the bag, not just to it. Ready? Power. Come on. Turn it on. You can also now go 95, 100% on the power. Ah, ah, you're going to burn out in three, in two, and one. 15 seconds. Come on. Work. Go for it. Final little phase here. We got power coast freestyle. Three, two, one. Let's go. Dig. Power your way onto the leaderboard, baby. Come on. Make your hard work count. Come on. Keep going, keep growing. Three, two, one. Back away from that bag. Proud of what you just put in. Take a deep breath in. Exhale out. Take another deep breath in. Exhale out. Now as we stand tall, as we stand victorious, crushing through four rounds of not so easy, combo build up. Let's go ahead and cool the body down. Remove those gloves. Place them gently or not so gently somewhere. And let's get after this cool down. Torso twist, nice and light. Elbows up because we're going to start throwing punches fast. That was fun. Hey, I wish I had a staples button over here. That was easy because I would not have rung it today. Now start bringing those punches up. Give me a lead hook. Then a rear hook as you torso twist. Just getting those rotational muscles. A little cool down here. Can't believe we did it. Oh, 
Can't believe we made it. Now I said that was 15 punches on the combo, right? Give me some arm circles forward. That was four rounds of nothing but punches. And I'm so proud of you crushing it. But if you wanna be real about it, you know, you had a lead block, you had a rear block, you had two slips, you had a roll. So technically it's more like, you know, you know, 20 punch combo, we'll say that. Here you go, 20 movement combo. Drop one knee down all the way to the ground from this position here, just drive those hips forward. Even though we did not use the legs in any plyos, they certainly got working, all right? Speaking of getting working, I gotta give a shout out to Stephanie Ward up for, from Buffalo, New York for doing a 25 minute strength workout with me. So proud, way to keep that hard work up. And uh, yeah, this one is dedicated to you. I hope to give each and every person a shout out in these workouts, but you gotta try one of the new platforms. All right, strength, we got conditioning, recovery, post-workout stretch. Try your best to fit them in throughout your schedule. Not only will they help you train like a fighter, but you'll start seeing amazing results on your output, on your punch score. Hey, you might be ranked in the top three all the time. Take a seat on the ground. Give me a hurdle stretch. I want you to reach that right hand out towards that right foot. As we're still breathing and as we are still enjoying the hard work that we just did, I want to commend you for working on a flow, staying controlled with chaos and then drilling, drilling, drilling. It's so important to drill, which is why I can't stress enough to come back to workouts like this. Take it two, three, four times. Switch. So we worked on our counter punching. We got quicker with our blocking reflexes and we pieced together some pretty long combos. I'd say that was a win. Now, speaking of wins, sometimes having some fun and laughing a little bit is the best one of all. Rise under your feet as champion you are and let's go. What did the duck say when it bought lipstick? Put it on my bill. I <laughs> get it, duck. Bill, you know what I'm trying to do. We have some fun. We enjoy and we endure through our entire workouts. Way to get after it today, crushing through four rounds. So proud. Can't wait to see you on the leaderboard. Until the next time, Coach PJ signing off. Peace and love. This is Fight Camp, an interactive training camp from the comfort of your own home. Tutorials and guided paths walk you step by step through the basics and sharpen your technique over time. Punch tracking technology and leaderboards provide you built-in motivation to help you hit your goals. Learn more at fightcamp.com. Workout, and I don't expect you to be going non-stop.